Hello guys, this is Navicaz Fun, and today I'm going to be showing you floating houses and a tutorial on how to do them because I've already made a video on floating houses and but I didn't do a tutorial for them because I didn't think that it was public but I can make it public for you guys because I love you guys so first of all you got to get this down and the server you're on sorry to say is for the people who will have a certain server they want to make one on you're gonna have to move to an oxide server I'm not actually I'm not 100% sure if that's how you pronounce it but let's just Let's just say you press now, pronounce it oxide. So oxide servers have lots of commands such as the remove command. So first off you want to act, you want to just type in chat slash or forward hash forward slash remove. You'll come up with remove activated and boom. Boom. And so on. So on some on some ser some servers you actually get your item back on this one unfortunately you don't so I can't show you an actual full-on house but yeah this is basically what you're gonna what you're gonna get if you try to make a floating house so let me just actually finish this up I'll, I'll be back in one sec after I've crafted these things alright guys I'm back so what you will need to do is put the pillars underneath the top pillars otherwise you're not going to be able to place those pillars up because as you know, pillars have to be placed on top of pillars or on foundations, and you can't actually place them on the ceiling. So let, once you've got what you want down, get rid of the, as I said, use the remove kit. Oh, and if you want to get out of the remove activated thing, then all you need to do is type in the same command. So let's get rid of this foundation. Now let's go up. So these are going to be great for suicide bases. I know a lot of people are against this, but I'm just showing you guys how to do it. Just for the sake of showing you guys how to do it because I don't want any of you my wonderful viewers slash subscribers to be disadvantaged so this is how you do it alright so we got this down uh, let's just there we are put these down so no one can get in and then put our ceiling down wherever that is alright we use the ceiling as a floor but you guys know what I mean so now after we've done that, we can actually get rid of this ramp. I'm not actually going to get rid of the ramp just because, well, we want it to be able to get up until we can make a sleeping bag, which I can't make yet because I don't have any cloth. So there you are. That's our little house. It's actually, you can make it as tight as you want, get rid of as much as you want. It's a lot easier if you are on a server with, with the function where you get your items back after you've broken them. This used to be a server. There you can see... 31 wood foundations. I just moved my bases all around. That metal base actually isn't mine. I'm not sure whose that is, but anyway. So this has been Navicaz Fun. If you guys like, or if you enjoy seeing me do Rust videos, or you enjoy Rust videos, then make sure you subscribe. If you like this commentary or this video, then leave a like. And if you have any suggestions, then leave a comment. Alright, guys, this has been Navicaz Fun. Bye.